Hi, I'm Patrick Donnelly, founder of Donnelly Financial Services. Today I'm going to be talking about what may be the single most important concept to understand as an individual investor and one of my personal favorites to introduce and discuss with clients. It's known as the behavioral gap and it's crucially important to understand when executing a successful long-term investment strategy. Okay, the behavioral gap. What is it and why is it important to understand? The behavioral gap is a term used to describe emotionally charged investment decision making, often during times of volatility and the majority of time to the individual investor's detriment. The term was actually coined by a certified financial planner to explain this phenomenon that we saw when looking at large scale long term investment data. And essentially, the data showed that over a long term period, market returns far outperformed individual investor returns, creating this gap. And so this gap or differential in returns can be explained through behavioral economics. Basically what the data shows is that investors tend to overbuy when times are good, but even worse, tend to panic and sell when times are bad. This is the core reason that leads to lower individual investor returns versus the market, hence the behavioral gap. A perfect example of the behavioral gap playing out in real life would be the 2008 and 2009 financial crisis, where we saw the US housing bubble burst impacting many of the largest financial institutions in the US and ultimately sending the US economy into the Great Recession during which time the market was dropping hundreds if not thousands of points a day and you saw many panicked investors ultimately selling large portions of their investment assets. During 2009-2010, we saw a nice recovery in the US economy and ultimately the US stock market reached its previous 2008 peak back in 2011. What this shows is that if you're able to stomach even horrible economic downturns and maintain a long-term vision for your investment strategy, you will ultimately gain higher returns than trading in and out of positions trying to time the market and emotionally selling. So as discussed, there will be more bear markets. It's well understood that the market is cyclical and that throughout any given lifetime, it's very likely that we will see several economic downturns of varying degree during which how do you avoid falling victim to that behavioral gap and those inferior investment returns? Simply put, it really comes down to confidence, confidence in your long-term portfolio strategy and understanding that through having a diversified portfolio across several asset types, across multiple geographies, across multiple sectors, hopefully, that provides you the confidence and peace of mind to truly enjoy those market up cycles and, and reap the rewards of, of an investment peak, but be able to keep a level head and avoid those emotionally charged investment decisions during market lows. And so hopefully at this point, you understand the behavioral gap, why it's important and ways to avoid it. Thanks.